Hello and welcome to Beginner's Plate. Today I'm gonna share my recipe for cauliflower and chicken, also known as gobi gosht. So let's get started. I have chopped three green chilies, and I have chopped two medium-sized onions. And now I'm gonna start with heating up some oil in the pan. Once the oil is heated, I'm gonna add one teaspoon of garlic paste and one teaspoon of ginger paste, and I'm gonna mix these until they turn golden. Then I'm gonna add boneless chicken to the mixture and mix the chicken with the mixture. And then I'm gonna add the chopped onions. Then I have to mix the onions with the chicken. And then I have to wait until the chicken changes its color completely. This has to be done on high flame. Next, I'm gonna add the cauliflower and mix it with the chicken and onions. Once mixed, I'm gonna add one teaspoon of salt. One teaspoon of all spices, also known as garam masala. One teaspoon of turmeric powder. One teaspoon of coriander powder, and one teaspoon of red chili powder. And next, I have to mix all these spices with the chicken and cauliflower. After mixing, I'm gonna add one tablespoon of tomato puree, and then I'm gonna add half a cup of water, and give a gentle mix. After a gentle mix, I'm gonna cover this for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, I'm gonna remove the cover and see that the cauliflower has shrunk. So now it's easier to mix all the ingredients. So I'm gonna mix them all and cover again. After 20 minutes, I remove the cover and see that the cauliflower is cooked around 75% and the next cooking should be done without cover because we have to evaporate the excess water. After a few minutes, the cauliflower cooks perfectly and the water has evaporated as well. And now I'm gonna put the green chilies on top and remove the dish from heat and serve. 